Hey everybody, in today's video, I'm gonna be unboxing my latest trail camera purchase. This is the Solar Integrated Hunting Camera Model TC09. I bought this from seller L-I-B-J-Y on Amazon. As with all my purchases, I like doing unboxing videos just to kind of remember the things I've bought in the past in case there's somebody else out there thinking about buying the same item. They can get an idea of what does it look like when it comes in, what's the quality like, etc. So I'm going to do a quick unboxing, and then once I put this camera out, I will attach some sample images or videos uh, to the video so you can get an idea of what the quality is like. Again, this is the TC09. This camera has a built-in 4,400 milliampere battery that connects with a solar panel. So let's take a look at everything we get, and we'll take a look at the camera. We had an instruction manual. This is a full-size manual, and then they also give you a simple operating guide, kind of a quick start guide. And then just a little before you begin card. It's got some basic things on it, like make sure you format your uh, SD card, uh, take the plastic off, so on and so forth. Pretty traditional things you get with most trail cameras. You've got your cloth strap. If you wanted to run that through the back of the camera, put it around a tree. This one comes with a standard uh, Android charging cable. This is gonna be what we use to charge the solar panel and the battery pack that's in there. As with most solar panel items, you're gonna to wanna to fully charge it using this charging cord. And then once you put it out, if it's getting adequate sunlight, it will keep the battery uh, from going dead. According to the box, it looks like it'll last over a year. I've got a couple of these cameras. I don't have this model, but these cameras that have the built-in solar panels work really well. It's just a metal mounting hardware. There is a thread on the back of the camera if you wanted to use the metal mounting bracket to mount it. If you're using the cloth strap, you would just run it through the back here. I'll give you a glimpse of the back of the camera. So I mentioned that this one has a built-in battery pack. You can also run four AA batteries in the camera as well. If you happen to put AA batteries in, what it'll do is it'll use the battery pack first, and if the battery pack goes dead, it will kick in and run the AA batteries. I tend to run these just with the solar panel and the battery pack, I don't put additional batteries in. Let's a quick look at the camera. This company has a couple of different models. This is the least fancy uh, models because it doesn't have Wi-Fi or Bluetooth connection. It's just your basic camera. It is a 30 megapixel camera, 4K video quality. Here's a look at the inside of the camera takes a micro SD card, and then this would be where you plug in to do your charging. Show you the battery compartment. Again, if you wanted to run four AA batteries, you would be putting them in there. I'm not gonna power it on and go through all of the setup, but if you have any questions regarding the setup of this camera, post them in the comments, I'd be happy to help you out. That's a quick unboxing. Let's put it out and see what kind of video image quality we get.